Hi, I'm Chuck Ciccarelli, and I want to welcome you to the inside of the Renegade Explorer Motor Coach. I'm going to try to give you an overview of what to expect inside one of the typical bunkhouse models of Explorer coaches. As you walk in, I want you to notice the flooring. This is a Mannington resilient flooring, and the thing that's hard to tell is that it looks like plank flooring, and you can almost see the saw marks in it. We also equip these coaches with ceramic tile in either a polished or a honed finish. But in this particular coach, this is the Mannington DR161 flooring. Here's the flex steel dinette. And we've been equipping most of our coaches with the flex steel dinette. This is an optional dinette and the table does not fold down on this. It's also got a curve back to it, so if you want to kick back in the evening, you can put your back up against the wall and hang your feet out, and it's very comfortable. It also has the Corian solid surface polished countertop on it. The thing I like about the table being bolted solid is that when you go to pull yourself up from the table, it doesn't move, it doesn't wiggle, and it's just something that's going to last for years and years. Now we also do offer the wooden dinette with more of a bus style seating and the table will convert into a small bed if you have small children and some people really like that option as well. Here we're going to go ahead and slide the drawers out and whether you buy the flex steel dinette or the renegade booth dinette they both have drawers that slide out the bottom from extra storage. Now in this particular coach the wall board is the texture wall board we do offer it in a padded finish. This is the Bali style textured wallboard. Also notice the window treatments on this one. We've optioned this coach with wood trim and we have the day night shades that go up and down. We can also change it from a wood trim to more of a fabric decor package. Now you get into the cabinets and these are all solid maple and they are handmade by true Amish craftsmen. Here we're going to bring the lights down for you so you can see the different lighting levels that you can have to kind of set the mood. There's wall sconces, there's reading lights, just straightforward, good American design. Now we're going to move around to the flex fill hide -a bed sofa. This thing is just super, super comfortable. In this particular coach, we have the ultra leather fabric on it. It resists stains. When you spill a drink on it, you can wipe it off and it has just a really nice feel. It also has three seat belts in it so you can bring friends along or kids or grandchildren or whatever you have a place to secure them into the coach. Now we're going to go ahead and fold out the hide -a bed It does have an air mattress in it and they're very easy to inflate. This is just a little bit faster than real time. It comes with a 110 pump to inflate and deflate the air mattress. Now we're going to move into the control center of this coach and we're going to do a quick overview and then we're going to come back and talk about it in detail. Here's the first cabinet is the entertainment system. The front cabinet that we're opening now is where all the controls are. And then the left cabinet, we had Renegade design these for us and this is what we call our game cabinet. But I also want to draw your attention to the vent holes on top of the doors and there's air conditioning recirculating through the back of these cabinets to help cool down your components of your stereo and all that. I think it's just a really, really great function. Here we're going to go ahead and move into the entertainment system. This has the Onkyo home entertainment system. When you buy a coach from us at IWS, we program a remote so that everything operates off of one remote. There's extra 12 volt outlets, there's extra 110 outlets in the cabinets should you want to add some more features down the road. Now we're going to talk about the command center of this coach and Renegade's done a great job of installing these above the dash up high so that you can walk in and control everything. You don't have to get on your hands and knees to operate any of these functions. This is where you're going to find the auto generator start function and as I mentioned in the outside video it does a lot of things. One of the things that we can program this to do for you is when your battery voltage gets low it'll automatically start the generator. We can also tell it if it's in the summer we can say anytime the coach gets above 70 degrees or 80 degrees we want the generator to start and to turn the air conditioning units on. We can also have the generator come on at predetermined times, so we can tell it to shut off at 10 at night and restart at 6 a.m. in the morning. This is where the room slides are located. You can push a button right here and it'll tell you how much propane you have. It'll tell you how much storage is left in your gray or black tanks. It tells you how much fresh water you have on board what the battery conditions are. 
There's also an emergency generator start button and you would use that in the event that the coach batteries have depleted themselves. You can override the generator start button here and start it and charge the chassis batteries on it. This coach also has the auto level hydraulic jack system on it. Literally, if you pull into an RV spot, you turn the power button on, hit auto deploy, the coach levels itself, you power the slides out from here, and in less than five minutes, you've got your coach ready for a night's stay. I also want to point out that we do have an IWS Advantage package video that shows you how to use all of the functions on the jack leveling system. When you buy a coach from us at IWS, we're going to include our IWS value package or Advantage package, and we're going to give you an iPad loaded with a step-by-step -step video on how to maximize and use all of this stuff. I know it can seem a little daunting looking at all these electronics, but our crew's done a great job of breaking down the functions of each one of these in a step-by-step -step video, and they're exclusive to the people that buy coaches from IWS. Here's a close-up of the cabinet that we installed for your gaming consoles and extra storage for your laptop and all of that. Now as we pan around over the entrance door, a quick little feature to point out here is that Renegade mounted the coat racks over the top of the door so when you come in and your coat's wet you can hang it up there and then it'll drip down onto the stairs. You'll see the 32 inch television. We can also install a 42 inch TV here you can see the TV comes out on a pivot and you can move it around so you get the best optimum viewing angle. Now we're going to talk a little bit about the flex steel recliner on this coach. As you see it moves out, you can position it around the coach anywhere you want. Another feature that we installed on this coach is the 15 inch fold up counter extension. It's really nice and also notice when you move the recliner out it's a great place to store extra groceries or a dog box. Now we're going to move into the kitchen area. The cabinets, as I mentioned earlier, just gorgeous on these coaches. They're standard in solid maple. We can also option them out in a solid cherry wood if you'd like. This particular countertop has the Corian Sorel color on it. We did the recessed cooktop and the sink so that you can cover them to get extra counter space. This is a very deep stainless steel residential style sink. It has a residential style faucet, a sprayer, pull out spigot on it. Anybody that's inside of this coach just loves it. Here we have the three burner gas stove on this particular coach and we have the microwave with convection oven. Also note that the backsplash on this coach is stainless steel. We can do tile, ceramic or porcelain. We can do the countertops in laminate. We can do them in granite. Really the choice is yours. Now we're gonna go through some of the under sink cabinets on them. Here's a little storage cabinet right here to put your scrub brushes and things like that. All of the drawers on these coaches have full length slides and they have soft closed closures. Now we're gonna talk a little bit about the 18 cubic foot residential refrigerator and freezer. This refrigerator is made by Samsung. It has dual French doors on it, has lots of storage in it for hitting the road and staying out for a long time without having to stop and go get more groceries. There's several options on the refrigerators from nine cubic foot to 13, 18, all the way up to 20 cubic foot. We can do them with ice makers in the doors or ice makers in the freezers. We even have a freezer for the outside that can go underneath the coach. Now we're gonna walk you into the bunk bed area of this coach. There's about five foot from the bunk beds to the bathroom door, so there's a lot of room for the kids to get out and play. Just tons and tons of floor space. Each one of the bunk beds has a window. It's also an emergency exit. Each bunk bed has its own light source in it so they can read. Each one has a 19 inch television with a DVD player. Notice we also installed an extra 110 outlet. This particular bunk is 30 inches wide and 72 inches long, so it's a lot bigger than you would find. Probably the biggest selling feature of this particular style of coach is that when the slides are slid in, you still have access to the back bedroom. Many of the bunk beds on the market, when the slides are slid in, you cannot access the rear bedroom. Now we're gonna move around into the bathroom. This has the solid maple cabinets. It has the textured wall board. This one has a optional vessel bowl sink, which I personally really, really like. 
You can see there's a extra 110 outlets there above the sink. Renegade uses full glass sliding doors into the shower. As I said, I'm over six foot tall. There's plenty of room inside of this shower. It has a skylight in it. But the ceiling height in this coach is incredible to start with. Here's a shot of the linen closet. You can also see there's a mirror above the sink. Here's the double sliding doors as we enter into the master bedroom of this coach. Lots of room. The cabinets, goes without saying, are just gorgeous. Beside the bed, there's a all-in-one washer and dryer combo. So it's a washer and a dryer. If you don't want a washer and dryer, we would equip this coach with just shelves in there so you could turn this into a linen closet. Very similar to what you're gonna see when we open up the top drawer. A lot of people really like to have that washer and dryer when they're on the road. Here's a shot of the overhead cabinets that are over the top of the bed. There's a nightstand. We can, depending on the floor plan you choose, we can do a nightstand on either side of the bed. Another great feature is that there's a 110 outlet above the nightstand so you can charge your cell phone. Slide out drawer where you can put your car keys. On some of the explorers, we equip it with the generator start button by the bed so you can start the generator from the bedroom. Now we're gonna take a little bit of time and go through some of the cabinets at the foot of the bed. Now, this coach has all the cabinets at the foot of the bed. If we do a different design, we can do a slide out, full walk-in closet out the back. Again, the choices are unlimited. Now we're gonna move back up into the cabin, the chassis portion of the coach, and notice that the passenger seat will pivot around and face towards the back of the coach. Both of these seats are air ride. They're bi-flex steel. We can have them heated if you wanted. This is just kind of a quick pan across the dash to give you an idea of some of the functions that are available. Here you can see the docking lights and what they are is two lights that are mounted on the side of the coach towards the back. So when you're backing up, you can turn them on to help get extra lighting coverage at the back. There's a high-low engine brake. Again, this engine isn't an exhaust brake, it's an actual engine brake and you have a high and low settings. You can raise and lower the air suspension and then the regen is just the uh, emissions control on it. Here's the mirror heaters. This has full heated mirrors. All the coaches that we're stocking at IWS or what we recommend is when it comes to automatic transmission as we're using the Allison 3200 series transmission. Here you can see the locking rear differential switch, which is really nice. And what that does is under normal driving conditions, only one wheel provides power. Should you get stuck, you push that button and it locks both rear wheels together. So in a sense, you have four wheel drive. Here you can see the the speed control or cruise control and all the other functions there. Now we've got the Kenwood in-dash stereo system. We have a IWS Advantage package video that shows you how to use this thing to its full capability because there's an awful lot here to go through. We're just going to kind of pan around and show you some of the functions on it. It has navigation and it is preloaded with the Rand McNally RV maps in it which is very very handy. Here you would enter the length and width of your coach, which we've already done for you. And what it's going to do once you've loaded all these is it's going to show you which routes you can and cannot go down. Again, there's just tons of things to talk about on these coaches. I just want to really encourage you to either come by and give one a test drive or give us a call and let us help you answer all the questions so that you can become a really informed buyer before you buy one of these things. Here we're going to show you a quick uh, shot of the backup camera. We can also equip your coach with a trailer backup camera. So you can have a camera that shows the back of the coach and then also one that shows the back of the trailer. We can also equip your coach with side bullet mirrors so that when you turn on your turn signal, it switches the camera view to that side. As you can gather as we went around this coach, there's tons and tons of options. My name's Chuck Ciccarelli. I'm the president of IWS Motor Coaches and I personally want to invite you to stop by or give us a call and give one of these coaches a test drive. Thanks again for your time.